We are going to be playing Layers of Cognition from Narcodes. Uh, it should be no surprise to anybody who was here last night because um, we actually got to it and then I was like, you know what, we'll leave that for tomorrow. Doctoress here, what's going on, Doctoress? And uh, Tatsal Grief. Hey, hey, hey. Alrighty then, this is Layers of Cognition. Hard map for experienced players. Experienced player? Oh dear. Which utilizes the portal on off concept and every B mod field once. Every B mod field once, wow. In order to solve the map, you have to know their properties and how they interact. You can check the overview table in the map pictures. Okay. No execution skill is required, but it is eight out of 10. Angled lasers through wall portals are part of the solution. Okay. We'll do Tatsel. We'll do. We secretly now codes in disguise. Which confuses me when people don't have their, uh, they have different names. It's clear, it's clear. It's clear. A list of unintended things, cue climbing and jumping is not intended. All right, let's disable the spacebar. Um, list of obviously intended things, glitches, speedrun, and it's cube tossing, walking on deactivated field, it's like emitters and mid-air shots. Uh, white ceiling and the floor surface of port magnets with fixed orientation, narrow ceiling and floor surfaces have to be shot while standing in line with them. Uh, the floating platform in the top area has a button which controls the portal gun similar to the yellow button. Okay, interesting. And the white button. The white field remains deactivated for at least one second. The lift has no connection and oscillates all the time. If you get stuck, wait a few seconds if your solution requires you or a cube to get jammed between lift and floor. You're doing something wrong. Um, return path uh, triggers research progress. Bottom relay deactivates the entire... I didn't want to expect it like a, a full-blown freaking essay before we get going here. I think my brain's going to be fried before we even get into the map. Okay. <laughs> Cube shielding, holding cube in front of you towards the uh, turret is not intended. The turret is super strong. Ah, uh, we had some of those in one of Libby's maps, didn't we? As long as it's alive, the marked area under the purple field means instant death. Burning it doesn't require a tight angle. Aiming at the legs is recommend legs recommended, but a background mechanic will ensure that it gets killed, even if you're aiming between its legs. The absolute fizzler timer is long enough to shoot different portals, though, and also long enough for the player cube to pass. It's too short to get the lift portal and back again. Um, the timer on the green field button is long enough to get to one cube, one cube on top by holding it above your head. No ninja stuff. Uh, There's no issues, useful things. Thanks to, we'll stick with that bit. Uh, thanks to Libby for playtesting technical help and advice and support. I also have to thank Nobody No One and Haru for playtesting the previous iteration as well as Leo and Mr. Clay for technical help. Um, Music is Placid by Mevius, and a bit of trivia. The map is a remake of my Layers of Fatality, which was a remake of my older map, Layers of Consciousness. I'm seeing, I'm seeing a bit of a theme here. Seeing a theme. Um, in 2020, there was also a third non-public iteration of the map. The current overhaul embodies the true final version. Most main ideas from the original map are still present. Feedback and playthrough videos are welcome, and feel free to ask for hints. Um, and have fun. Have fun. That's a lot of instructions. You're damn right. What's going on, Team Spin? How you doing? Welcome, welcome. Um, let's go on, Deathwish. You're on the phone. I will walk very slowly while you are on the phone. Can you make it before I get to the chamber? Get to the chamber. Alright, so you got the little helpers similar to um, Libby's maps. Alright, what do we got here then? We've got two things that don't auto respawn and one that does. So a cube that auto respawns two laser cubes that doesn't well that wasn't very helpful was it okay 
Seriously though, if it um, if it took Mike two hours and two days, it was Mike Stroh who played the map who I referred to earlier on. Every by the way, um, every time the life wall center turns yellow, the turret gets spawned. What? What sort of tomfoolery is this? Oh my goodness me. Yeah, it took, if it took Mike, like, two hours of video and two days of playing to solve the map, then, uh, I have to say that, um, I don't think that's going to be a wise idea. Okay. So... That's what I was thinking for that. I'm pretty sure that's going to be death, right? Oh no, we can pass through there. Okay, maybe it's only physics objects then. The only physics objects? I really should look at the uh, the whole thing. So that's going to be the portal thing. I'll be the um, the thing that was similar to the other thing. I'm just going to take a time and like properly investigate everything, I think. What's going on, Era? How you doing? Can it be my own map, Coco? Okay, that's on a, like a two second timer. Okay, this is to me indicating some way, shape, or form that um, we need to rotate a cube through there, possibly. Okay. So let's carry on. Now we can walk on here, can't we? Yes, we can walk on the compressed smoke fields. Going crazy, how you doing? Okay, so this is my on-off. Stopping by for a sex. Wrong place, buddy. Wrong place. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so we get a cube over there, and we would be able to do stuff there, right? Okay, so that blocks that. So the area under the purple field is instant death, basically. Hey, I wasn't under the purple field. How dare you. Oh, jeez. Good start. The map lied to me, though. Um, I feel hurt. All right, so ultimately, we're going to want a cube here. Turn off that purple fizz, all right. That's fine. We guess that. So you look, area under... It's doing it again, look. It's doing it again. So high turret. There's uh, some interesting things in there. Something red in there. I wonder what that is. Will we ever find out? Once it's on a postcard. 
All right, so, um... I guess here... I'm gonna wanna do something like this, right? And we can return back down to here. Drops us all the way down. I don't know that I can... Oh, actually, I could. Okay. So... Oh, no. So, yeah, I was going to say, I think I could probably do this. But, yeah, that's going to get stuck. And then we might end up losing the collision on that cube. So, when you stop it. Going well, Deathwish. How about your good self? So, what are you going to do? What are we going to do? Alright, maybe we should try... Do anything with the cube now, I wonder. So now we could maybe swap the cubes. All right, Mika, no worries. Have a good one, buddy. Have a good one. Okay, so we did this. From here... I can do this. Back on the compressed smoke fire. Now, what does this actually do? Same as that one. Ah, interesting. So that disables that. So we could now, in effect... Okay. So, we're going to want to do a save. Yeah, compressed smoke fields block absolutely everything, Coco, so... No, I actually think... I can't remember if... I think... I can still shoot here. Yes, okay. That's where we want to shoot, I think, because that would make more sense. We can do the thing with the green. Um, hold on, though. 
The only issue with that is... Do we maybe now go and... Also, as well, that's quite interesting. We can also reverse the life form sensor. Does that help us in any way? Possibly. Let's not get bogged down with that, though, at the minute. What I want to do... Let's not get bogged down by that at the minute, and then he goes and does it anyway. So, now if I'm here, oh yeah, Say now that I'm here, I could do this, right? But there's an issue with this, isn't there? I can't pass through the orange field. It's probably gonna be death. Nope, we're just gonna get crushed. Okay, so. That's not it. Okay, I want to check my rules for something already. I'm already thinking about something. Um, It doesn't say anything about that that I'm aware of, so... Okay. No worries, crazy. Have a good one, dude. Catch you later. You know what I could do? I, I can... So, all right, I'll show you what I was thinking of. I don't know if it's a move that we need to keep for later, although I can't even do that. So, what I was going to do... Get the cube up here. I don't know if anybody's got the answer to this question, but... I'm guessing, like, doing something with these... It's not really going to help me, though, anyway, is it? That really wouldn't help me. Alright, I'll reload the save. Let's reload the save. Okay. And we are back to here.
So I could... Okay, what if I did, did that? I feel like that's what we had before, but I'll try it again. Oh. Okay. Okay, did a thing. Did a thing. Now... What thing could we do next? Let's think about this. We could actually drop down there, couldn't we? We have portals at this point, this this moment in time as well. So let's drop down here. Okay, that's a full reset. I'm guessing if I shoot here as well. Um, I can't remember what it said about that one. Okay. I misinterpreted that then, I guess. Okay, so we could now potentially... Portals aren't necessarily that important at the minute. So we could now get this cube back out, potentially. I 
Okay. Then from here, we could maybe use the laser like so. Okay. That's activated something up there. Now. Oh, I want to burn the turret in the elevation room. What even is that? This is on a postcard. Alright, so this is all well and good. But yeah, the issue is now. Oh, okay, so that, I think that, that's what that does then. That activates that, I think. Oh, sorry, deactivates that. So that looks like that's end end game, right? Okay. Maybe an idea. Only maybe an idea. I could go back through the life form sensor here then. Portal. Yeah. I'm just gonna drop down there just to keep the life form sensor rating window. Oh, you know what? I think I just saw. Yeah. Okay. I just potentially saw how we could... Okay. Hold, I'm going to hold that thought for a minute, but I just saw how we could get the um, other cube. Maybe. Hmm. Actually, I don't know. Uh. Well, yeah, it would work. Would work? Would work. Maybe. That would need to be on there. Given that this is like the only floor pole here. I think the way to do it is to force that to spawn. Let me just simulate. We'll reset in a minute. 
Let's see, we kind of like do this. No? Okay. Well, we could potentially, if that was set on there. Uh, yes, no, that would work. That would work. So, what I'm thinking is, and I know this is like very let's pretend sort of stuff, so I do apologize. But we would have. Let's just do this for a minute. Clear our portals. Get a portal there. Then we're somehow able to get back. All in on some, uh, somehow. We'd like. Yeah. So we'd need a, the laser cube on the portal position. That cube already spawned and waiting for us. And we could do that. Did I not put the cube on the thing? Anyway, I think I think you kind of get what I'm trying to do here. It's it's like that would drop onto there. We'd shoot that there. And then we catch this cube as it falls out there. So. Ah, Deathwish wants to know some airboats. Final. Conclan has put the final nail in the coffin here. What am I doing? I have no idea. All right, anyway. Um, yeah, so I think that's possibly how we could do that. Now. The big issue with with that is I would need to hmm. At the minute, I don't see a way. I don't see a way to... And I'm sure it'll come later on in the map, but I don't see a way to have a portal in there. I would kind of need to do what? I guess the cube would already need to be spawned there. Oh, of course, the other cube also respawns. Okay. That could be the key. That could be the key. But, um... It's still not as... It's still not clear-cut, though, is it? Alright, anyway. Let me, um... Let's go back. So, we're going to do that and that. Now, what did I do next? Did I do... What was I going to do next? That's the $64 million pound question, isn't it? Coco close. Well, I don't. I don't know if it's over yet, but um, wonder if Coco was closer than me. All right, that's. I wish I hadn't gone off on that tangent now because we 
Right, I think I remember what I was going to do. I think. Alright, so yeah, we went down here. We went through here. We then set a portal on there. And then we respawn the cubes. That's what we did. the uh, cube up there, but... Okay, so from here... Oh, wait a second. Do this. Okay. That turns off with that button there, so that's fine. So now I think. Go around here. Go down to here. Maybe, maybe it's not all doom and gloom. Everyone but Coco is dead. What did you do to everybody? your money, dude. Okay. The cubes here. Oh man, I was like miles off. I was miles off. I'll do that because that's going to fizzle out. Okay, so we set up the same thing here, maybe.
but this time we go for a portal there instead. But all that does is help us to get that across to here. Which, in the grand scheme of things, doesn't help us. See, all we've done here is go backwards. Uh, the one's just the bot points, uh, which was around a long time before Twitch points was around, Coco. I think on Twitch it's like every five minutes. So every five minutes I think you get... Uh, now I want to say it's ten. It may be less and it may be more boats. Um, but if you if you subscribe you actually earn more. And then every... Every so often... There's... Uh, you get like a little green treasure chest pop up. And if you click that you get kind of bonus points. Maybe it's more frequently than five minutes. Can't remember how often it is that the like the chest pops up, if I'm honest. interesting. I get 70 on another stream, but I think that's probably because um, I've got a tier 2 subscription on that screen, on that stream, so that's probably why I get more. Okay, I noticed that it wasn't important, but I'm starting to think that getting the third cube is actually more important than I first thought. issue we have there, isn't it? Mm. Alright, let's go back to this state. I thought it was 50 death wish just for, if you're not subscribed, I think it was 50. 60 for a tier 1, 70 for a tier 2, uh, I don't know, for tier 3.
used to be a lot more when they first introduced channel points, but then they've um, you know, nerfed it a bit because people were just amassing loads of points quicker than they anticipated. So this is where we were before. Way before. I think uh, a lot of people just want to be lurking. I think that's the uh, the reason Coco. People want to lurk. All right, I think there's some serious thought as to what we're actually, what we can do here. I almost feel like go back a minute. I almost feel like we need to we need to what knock? We need to what? To be honest, I'm still pretty sold on the third, the third, how I'm going to get the third cube. Yeah. My only, the only way I can think and I can conceive getting the third cube revolves around having a portal there. I mean, I'm pretty sure... That would be pretty unintended if you were completely honest, but some serious air control. Taking, uh, I don't know if it's in the rules, is air strafing? Yeah, shots. So, yeah. That's a shame because we could. Uh, Possibly shot that, drop down. Could drop down here. Walk through here. Although, I'm not really sure what we would have done from there. Can I open a ball? Okay. But I'm still convinced that I need to somehow. Oh, hold on. I was going to say, wouldn't it be really easy to get a portal on there? Because if I did something like this, actually. Okay, that could work. That's the way I could get back over to here. Oh, that's death. Don't worry. So that's the way I could get back over to there. 
Beth which wants to uh, join in. That's why I can get it back over there. Now, what I would need to do there, though, is I'd need to um, think of a way that I could... All right, let's... Hello! Hello. <laughs> How are you doing tonight, my man? Yeah, not bad. Not bad, you know. We're, uh... Doing the thing with the thing. Get the thing. Yeah. Doing the thing with the thing and the thing. That's the one. Got it. Yeah. All right. Oh, I got away from the portal surface. Okay. All right. So, I could do that. I could do that. Now I could press this button and pull to there, and then I can go over here. There's my surface where I want it. Yeah, stream invasion. How dare you? How dare you? Hey, shag out. Shag out, Coco. The closest. <laughs> uh, so close to getting 10 bucks. Hey, okay, uh, so. You have to say that, uh, hey, I did live up to the hype. Uh, I give away games and stuff. Didn't like the games. Some bucks. Dude, what is going on with your mic? Did you see the message that I posted on that video the other day for you? No, no, I don't. Uh, have you got like a noise gate or something on your active all the time on your microphone? I probably do so that it, if I talk too low, that's everything off. Yeah, because when I was watching your video the other day, it was very like in and out and it was um um i think it's kind of like i think you were talking the whole way through the video but because i think your noise gate was activating or deactivating it was like you were hardly talking on the video at all that may be true i think the reason why uh is typically i, I talk loud Due to my awesome hearing. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I tend to talk louder than normally would. Uh, and enunciate, try to enunciate more. Uh, and then when I get kind of lax and like I'm tired. Yeah. And, and yeah, the noise gate that will cut it off. Part of that is also due to the fact that if I have instead of wearing my headphones, if I play through my speakers, I can hear my speakers without it uh, getting feedback into my mic. They're, yeah. You know, that kind of thing. So, yeah. No, I totally get it. I try to remember it and try to speak up. But sometimes I get lazy. It's kind of like. <laughs> anyway, so what's your thoughts now? So, what I need to do is I need to. I need to only have one portal, I think. But I don't know how to clear my other one. But I'm thinking... If I only had a portal on there, and I could somehow get back to the spawn area... With... Alright, let me, let me demonstrate. Here's what I'm thinking. Because that respawns anyway. And then we'll do 
This is what I was trying to demonstrate earlier and failed miserably. That would have to be the laser cube. That would be there. Like that. Get rid of that. The laser cube would have to be here. So my thought process would be... I would be in here. I could stand here. That would cause that cube to respawn. That's how I think I get this third cube. Now... So there's the, the, the issue with that... Is... Reload save. The issue with that is that hinges on a only having a portal on. Well, we're gonna have to put a portal up there for a start and then get out somehow, but we need to clear one of our portals, and I don't see a way to clear one of our portals. That's the issue. Oh, there's fizzlers and can't clear portals. <laughs> yeah, but I only want to clear one pole. That's the thing. The flip panel. Yeah, there's... Uh, well, I haven't seen a flip panel. Yeah, we would kind of do this. Unless I'm missing a surface, which I don't think I am. But there is no other floor surface or anything like I even to entertain this. Okay, so, uh, that's so brief. That's your Twitch name, Arcades. These, uh, secret squirrel people, man, with their overt names. That's to that was, that's too uh, time constrained to do that. So that means I have to get rid of this orange fizzler. Do that. We rest this up here. thing this map is missing a certificator. Certificator. Yeah. Well, the last time we had a certificator on a map, the, uh, the map didn't work, so 
I'm pretty glad we haven't got a syndicator, if you ask me. Uh, it only worked because of you. Alright, well, maybe. Um... I like the random bit of Evergreen. What you've done now, Deathwish. Look what you've done now. Oh! oh. Certificator and crushers? Awesome, dude. Can't wait for that. We just add in a couple extra fizzlers while you're at it. Oh. Don't forget turrets. <laughs> this one's already got turrets, man. We don't need any turrets in the next map. Ah. More turrets. You never have too many turrets. Alright. So interestingly here, got a bit of a different setup. Hey, is this an export, a B export to hammer? Can't Ex do the, can't do the uh, overgrown bit there. B mod. You can do everything else in B mod. Hold on. Player has Tourette's. <laughs> Son of a bit! <laughs> Bob Saget! Oh dear. Oh my god, that, that YouTube channel back in the day. Oh, Bob sang it! <laughs> oh my god, that was so great. They did pull that off like it was. Speak up, man. You keep going in and out. Uh, really? Mm-hmm. Damn, I'm right next to my mic. You're literally like halfway should through I... a sentence and then it like you just drift out. Did I swallow the mic then? I mean... Maybe. Maybe that'll work. <laughs> Alright. Well, Alright, so. It wasn't too bad earlier on when we was um, chatting on Discord. I don't know, is there any like I don't know if there's any advanced options on Steam itself, is there in the Steam chat? Oh, you wouldn't. You wouldn't, would you? Do you think he would, Deathwish? Do you think he would? Alright, um, I'm going to ask the question. I'm going to ask the question because I have to ask the question. Is that a thing? It is a thing. Oh. Okay. So if that's a thing...
If that's a thing. Hmm. The next thing that it needs to do, we need to get the laser cube up to the top, don't we? Again. So. Alright, let me go back to my save. Go back to the save, and we will do... Where are we? Are we in a good position? Mm. Potentially not. Uh, you see, the problem here, though, right, is that... In order now to <sighs> Yeah. So in order to do anything because of where that cube is, I'm gonna need to Yeah, we're gonna need to respawn. Should have I mean, that's... I'm not happy with that. But yeah, we're going to need to respawn that cube there. Alright, so I think we might need to... Um, might need to start this bit again. Hello? Hello. Can you hear me? I'm again through to you. Yeah, my... OBS was on and apparently it was affecting me. Yeah, OBS was on it was affecting your microphone. Yep. Everything does. You know, you still seem a bit in and out, dude. I'll be honest. I trying to figure it out, but while I do, you want to. All right, let me put the this cube in the top. Take this one through. Then we're going to do... This. Bring the laser cube through here. have that. We've still got a cube there. Now. I feel like We would need to Oh, we're gonna need to take this back, I think, for a time being. Because we need a cube. Uh sorry, we need the laser to deactivate uh Could be a mistake, so I'm going to save. So we do that. Yeah, got it.
Got it. Got it. Are you sure about that? Nope. Yeah, I was noted in the notes, Coco, actually. Okay. Here's what we're going to need to do from here. We're going to need to... Get our portal back. Better off point a pull there, wouldn't we? Oh. Just trying to think, like, what the best setup here is going to be. So we've got no portal gun to fire anyway. So that's not going to be the issue. That's not going to be right. Right? What? 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 Still with us, Deathwish? You see, the issue is... The issue is... What is the issue? Wait a second. Okay. Let's do this.
go down to here. see something. I just seen something. Ah, so close. Death wish has, has died a horrible death. Okay. Does that help? Is that a better setup than what we had? Incoming call from Deathwish808. Will you accept the charges? Hello. Dude, I swear down, like. <laughs> Dude. You hear me? Yeah, there we go. I can hear you now. I, uh, steam mic went. Nope, you've gone. You, you choppy again, man. You don't believe it helps, and the shot while standing away from the regular fizzer is rather illegal. Uh, I suppose so, because there was something in the description about no shooting in the air, wasn't there? Okay. Well, I totally understand why it doesn't help, because... All right. I don't know if you've done it on purpose, but you are muted and deafened. So, um, yeah, it wouldn't help anyway because we would have to now we'd have to drop down. All right. What can we do? Can I lean on the railing? Will that help me? I'm slowly going mad with the sound of that freaking platform going. Up and down, up and down. Can you hear me now? I can hear you at the minute, yeah. I'm going to count 10, 1, 5, 
cuts off. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Oh, we got no six. We got no five. We got no four. We got no three. Ten. I don't know what the fuck is going on. Have you checked your mic settings in Discord to see when the uh, drop-off levels in Discord are on and whatnot? Yeah, yeah, I just did that in Discord. I did it Windows, I did it Steam. Nothing's changed and like everything. Doesn't seem to work. Steam, baby. Uh, it's automatically muting mic. It's uh, just like it's, it's honestly just like you've got like a a noise gate on, and it's just like like the volume's not loud enough, so it keeps cutting your microphone in and out because you're not making enough noise. It's really bizarre. Yeah, let me uh, do a little uh, control shift escape. See. There's something running that I forgot about. Anyone's always welcome on the stream, Mike. Hey, Dan, buddy. Welcome, welcome. How was your experience of hell? I was comparing, uh, I was comparing at the start of the map to your playthrough. I noticed that it was uh, a two hour video and the description said something along the lines of it took you multiple days to solve, so. That was um, very encouraging. <laughs> Very encouraging indeed. I got the cube. Jeez. You see, I'd like to put a pole there, but. I know that without having this yellow fizzle field off, I can't get back through there to do that. I know what's needed to like get the the third queue, which I'm going for my objective at the minute. But I just don't know. I say I know what's needed, but I don't know how to pull it off. And I'm pretty sure I've got to use this panel up here. I mean, one of the issues we've got though is. We can do that, but when we get rid of the it recesses back in the one at the top, so it doesn't really help me when I do that, does it? Likewise, this doesn't, um, this is quite, I think I can do anything from this state, so I think maybe we should just cut our losses, respawn the cubes and try again.
And the only thing that's really possible from here would be take that cube over there. I could go back over here. And this is almost back to a previous state. Whereby we had this. Which is all good. But once again. We... Yeah, we have that issue. So yeah, this is just basically doing what we did before, isn't it? Yeah, I don't believe that helps us. Um, I'm trying to think of a way to get the third cube. And I think the way I achieve that is with a portal there, a portal there, with the cube sat, like, with a cube sat there. So I need one cube on there, one cube on there. It's the getting back to the bottom, which is the issue. Because, like, that's all right doing this here, but I don't have a way to get back down to the bottom. But in effect, if I have that and that, and we somehow manage to get to the bottom, we can do that. The cube drops through, we pick up the third cube. That's what I'm going for at the minute. Do this, do this. Up there. That's bad timing almost. Okay, so we have that. I could respawn the cubes now, and that would get both the cubes down to this bottom area, but I don't know if that really helps me uh, to achieve anything different. I've got both cubes here and I've still got a portal surface there. Then I can potentially swap the cubes. I'm just going to overwrite the safe spot because clearly what we had there was not helping us at all. Now I've got to go around here. There's this really weird thing that, um, yeah, that Twitch does. And um, if for any reason you kind of um, fall behind, it kind of ever so slightly increases the playback speed to try and catch you back up again. So, yeah, every, all like the music and everything just sounds like absolutely whack. In the words of Fumbly.
All right, so we do that. We do this. We can walk through here. That was the wrong pole to shoot knock. That was the wrong pole. Also, let's break that miser. I don't like it anyway. Alright, back to here. Pull there. I think, like, maintaining this portal in that side is probably going to be key to the whole operation. Now, the thing here, though, is... How would we hit there whilst maintaining a portal in the dropper area? Because from this, actually, um, oh, actually, maybe I'm overthinking this. Depends if there's a way to respawn this cube. Yes. I think there is. Oh, no, there is totally a way to respawn that cube. There really is a way to respawn this cube. I'm not making it up at all. Okay. That cube now should be set up there. Yes! So here, we should just do that. We have a third cube. The one now. <laughs> Oh man, I got I got like completely I got completely sidetracked there. Like the whole um 
I, I thought for so long that I needed to keep that yellow field active. But really, the barrier was just the orange field. So, yeah. All right, cool. We have a third cube. I know I just didn't throw these cubes down here. That was pretty stupid of me. I know there's like meant to be no jumping and no... What the... Have you got some like cube deterrent here like to stop you from jumping on the frickin... cubes. It's like I'm being, like, forced off the cubes. <laughs> Alright, so... We have three cubes. Uh... Okay. So, first things first, save, second, open that panel up. Deathwish can't make his mind up like what he wants uh what he wants to chat on. Are you there this time? Or have you completely killed your mic? Alright, so um Doing that serves no purpose at the minute. Neither does that because we're going to need to. going to need to look at dealing with this yellow fizzler again, aren't we? It's going to be what we need to do next, for sure. What? Oh, hello. Uh, you can hear me now? I can now, yeah. Wow, okay. I want the whole shitload of setting. And you couldn't hear me just then, and then went to my window settings and uh, disabled my headset, which I don't actually have anymore because I literally cut it off physically. Like, it, it worked because it's a piece of shit. And I snipped the wires and all that, but I disabled it in software, so now, oh my god, no, you have no idea what's been going Well, uh, I hate to break it to you, but you still sound like a robot chopping, chopping, man. 
Uh, no idea why. Uh, but anyway, continue on. <laughs> <laughs> Makes no fucking sense. All right, so I'm just trying to remember what we did before, but we can get a cube over here. Uh, hold on. Let's think about this. Is that? Gonna cause issues. Yeah. Okay, we can get this up here. Man, knock, you need to be decisive, man. Jeez. So indecisive. It's like almost like I need two cubes in here now. I need two cubes on this level. One so that I can take one up there. And so we have one to open this and one to do that. Now the issue is Okay. I guess though this would be classed as Oh Metro Ham, what's going on? you doing this would be classed as yeah like jamming the lift so that wouldn't work About to upload a uh, a new map. Make sure you uh, send the link through to us. Uh, and we'll eventually get around to it and take a look. Is what you are looking for. This is really, really weird because oh actually maybe it's not as weird as I think maybe it's not as weird as I think let's use this one for now quick enough picking the cube up Hello there. We'll take this cube.
You know what? I want another one. Give me another one of them. Benefit of doing that, of course, is that one now appears at the top. So we can do... Oh, I've jammed the lifts. My bad. Sorry! I didn't mean to break the lift. Such a bad portal player. Oh yeah, I broke the monitor. But why is that sparking? Oh yeah, I know. Okay. It's good on Noob Hero, how you doing? Yeah, we're uh, we're on relatively recent maps now. Metro Ham, which is really nice. How's that going to help? Oh, you know what? I completely forgotten how I got the cube over here first, but of course we need to... <laughs> it's been a long time since you've been here last. Welcome along. Good to see you back. Got the poor back. I hear a death wish. I mean, he's back as well. got two cubes uh, up in this section. You're really quiet. Are you there? But you're really quiet, dude. Okay, I'll we'll swap them round. Then. I'll take this one. And we go and place it over here. Okay. Yeah. Really quiet again, still, so dude. You are there. Yeah, I'm actually fucking really quiet. Ah, uh, you're still choppy, man. What's going on, Adam? Um, I'm uninstalling some things. Only things? I think maybe you should uninstall some stuff as well. I think I should uninstall the the world universe my computer <laughs> and just 
But the fact that you can even hear me at this point is amazing. <laughs> well, you know, the, uh, the, the tin cans and the string is, um, between your house and my house across the pond is working pretty well now, so, you know, maybe we should just leave it at that. <laughs> okay. So. Here's where we are. With stuff. Um... Stuff. <laughs> you still can't get that test map running. <laughs> you have no idea, Mike. Like, literally, Deathwish is renowned for, like, having audio issues. You have no idea, like, every time we try and play something, you can guarantee one person has an audio issue and that person is Deathwish. Alright, so I've done all this. This is things and stuff that we've done. However, um, what next? What do we do next? I was thinking. Maybe what we need to do next is bomb the turret. Now I wonder if we could do something like... So we could do it to there. Like that surface there. So we need to point the laser. We need to use the laser without using the button. So I'm thinking... going to need a portal surface. In there. Now, to get this to work, we're actually going to want to do something else first. That would be down to there, wouldn't it? So we do that and that. Then... I'm going to remove this cube. Then we can place one there. Hmm. 
Let's just test out this theory though with a regular cube. I don't think we can see enough from here. Oh, it is down to the plant. Well, I do hear you. I hear you now. For now. What? You hear me? Yeah, for now. Like, I'm not cutting it out or anything? Like, clear as day. Holy shit. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> Something's wrong. <laughs> Wait, cancel the stream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I uh, restarted my computer for the uh, fourth time. I did uninstall some things. Uh, and oddly enough, I, I didn't even uh, join chat. I just loaded up Steam and loaded up uh, Discord and all of a sudden, I started hearing you. I don't even have Twitch open yet. And you're hearing me. I can see my voice coming across on my headshot. Uh, I okay. oh, must have spoken too soon. It was a bit choppy there, but it's, it's, it's like at least a good 50, 60, 70% better. 50, 60, 70 percent better or is better. <laughs> I don't know why, but yeah, just it's all on all kinds of shit. Uh, there are so many settings between uh, Microsoft settings, every guest setting, Steam setting, Discord settings, uh, you know. Uh, Audio settings were all over the place, and the the messed up thing is, is that I had everything perfect at one point. Like, you know, I was my daughter was using uh, my mic as uh, uh, to to uh, to no. uh, aud audition for a uh, role for uh, voice and stuff, and it sounded great. I mean, it sounded like there was no buzz, no nothing, it was super clean, and everything was great. And then I just walk away one evening, come back the day, nothing was started, nothing was done, and it was awesome. So what? So what you're saying is it's all your daughter's fault, right? I wish I could say that. But... <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, yeah, there's definitely some other garbage going. Uh, but I think I'm starting to get down to it. I I use uh, uh, Revo. Uh, are you familiar with Rubo on the top? No, I'm not, no. Ah, dude. Wow. I know you said no, a while man. ago that you was, like, trialing out some audio programs for, like, better quality, but then you never kind of said whether or not you was got it all ironed out and stuff? Yeah, actually, it got where everything was really, really good. Like, across the or like no matter how did I got it set up to where no matter what program I use it it's had it was the same across every and I okay. was like perfect perfect and then I swear worms I, I think it's worms worms fuck <laughs> blame it on the old blame it on the old game that can't defend itself <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> dude, uh, yeah, uh, if you go to not N I N I T E for, you know, that has a lot of the, the stuff that people want, uh, 
so you don't have to uh, like when you do a fresh install you can just go to and download them all you don't have to click or check on anything it just it doesn't install it, the garbage or any of that stuff it just installs it keep that keep that best up and then every now and then run it and it'll update them without issue and without any uh, click next or finish or any of that garbage. Shit's been around a long time. Still absolutely fantastic. Uh, I'm, what I'm looking at is uh, one of them uh, is Revo Staller and they have a version which I've never used but uh, the free version is absolutely fantastic because uh, it pulls everything up that you have installed uh, and then you can uh, yeah I mean stuff it, it uh, you can it automatically does say uh, if you allow it you don't have to it automatically Access the system restore, uh, and then once it's done uninstalling, you can uh, set it to scan uh, moderate to whatever to uninstall the garbage that programs sleep out. That normally, you know, when they install, yeah, they, they still leave a bunch of uh, it'll it'll delete all that garbage in your. Uh, different folders and and your and your uh, which we call it uh, registry. So yeah, uh, I mean I've been using it for many many years. It worked absolutely fantastic. So now let's see about any other. So at this point, can you say that for 90% of my words? No, it's still choppy, man. It's gone back to being choppy again. Oh, uh, that's your fault, goddammit! <laughs> that's it. Blame, blame, blame the guy on the other side of the pond. It's always his fault. Alright, shut up. Let me see if I can get something now. Fuck, what the fuck is Skype still doing on my computer? Jesus. Who uses Skype? Jeez. Got all what? about that, yeah. What a so, loser. Yeah. God damn it, man. I don't use it, I just got it still on here. <laughs> Alright, so. Here's where we are at the minute. I think. Well, I say this, I think maybe the next job is to get rid of the turret. And I'm assuming, and I should know, you should never assume, never good to assume. No. But I am assuming that uh, I don't know how I'm going to test this but if I was to I laser this turret somehow some way so let's destroy the turret like this hey I can't grab the turret What is this? Hello. What is this tomfoolery? Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Just wanted to test something.
I get that you wanted to test something. But... Everybody loves a bit of um, let's pretend, though. Let's pretend we're not. It's like one of the, the, the key features of our stream when we're solving puzzles. Um, Alright, let me try this. This should work. No headshot for me, I'm afraid. Assuming we destroy the turret, then we're free to walk around here. Okay. See, I'm pretty sure our next objective wants we're here, then we do the port there. We've quite a bit to go. But I think getting rid of the turret is next objective. So, is it possible to swap these cubes round? So what I'm thinking here is, if, if I could swap these cubes, I'm thinking, and let's pretend we're not. Narcodes, can you, you got a bit of a problem here? Seem to have like put this signage right in the way where I want to shoot this laser. Um, perhaps you could do a, a quick map update so that um, I can do that, please. <laughs> All right, well, answer that question. Solves that riddle. We cannot do it. This is impossible. There's a word for things like that. It's called you're a meanie. All right, well, if that's the case, I don't know at the minute how I would set up the laser. I'm pretty sure that to get rid of the laser, sorry, get rid of the, to 
to get rid of the turret, we're going to have to redirect the laser through one of these portal surfaces. And given what we've seen... Yeah, that wouldn't work, would it? Jeez. A stupid thing to try. An absolute stupid thing. Hey, he's back. That guy's back. No, I'm not. I'm cutting in and out, and you can't hear me. It's a figment of your imagination. <laughs> I beg to differ. Z I X V W T. Ask are you <laughs> this guy are crazy? P. Oh, and that mouth, yeah. F E D C. Yeah. Did you hear the whole thing? Uh, I heard a load of random letters. Yeah, it was just the, uh, it was a bit back. All right, so let's, 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 let's overview here what we've got. I think, I think... In order to uh, take out the turret... You're thinking! To... You're thinking! Holy shit! He's thinking! <laughs> the only way to use the laser to take out the turret is to angle the laser through a portal. The only portal surface that I think we can do that with is that one right there. So, kind of feel like we need to switch we need to switch cubes around but I don't know how to do uh, we can do that I can drop it down there okay Uh, did you get my uh, Steam chat message, by the way? Yeah, I did. I did. Um, I'll look at it and, and sort that afterwards. Okay. I, think I, I got the gist of what it said, so... Yeah, uh, pick it up. Pick that up to you. Yeah, yeah. It's all right. Cool. So, I feel like we've been here before. Honestly. Yeah, we ha we we have, but um, the difference being now we've got three cubes rather than two. Still feels like been here. This is like this map should be called Grab Day. Know what I mean, Graham? Uh, no. Hey, you know what we should do? We haven't done it in a while. 
o sea Do you know what I should do that I haven't done for a while? I should have a conversation with somebody who doesn't chop in and out. Oh, <laughs> uh, God, you must be talking about normal people. No, uh, Jackbox. Yeah, we haven't done Jackbox for a while, have we? Yeah, it's a good show, actually. Jackbox games. I was actually thinking, thinking the other day, I don't think I've actually streamed anything else other than Portal this year. Which is crazy. Since we finished, um, what did we play last? Since, since we finished The Walking Dead at the end of last year, we haven't actually streamed anything else but Portal. Eh, not the problem. Uh, you know, you get a little, uh, get a little crowd. You always got a crap. Uh, back boxes. That's a fun game. I don't know. I don't know how people couldn't like it. Yeah, Grant. Some are more fun than others, subjectively, so... You know. Yeah. But still, uh, even the ones I don't like the bears, it's still fun. I'll play them here. Still fun. Yep. Still fun. Still fun? <laughs> yeah. Still fun? Yep. Still fun. What about now? They're still fun? Ah, still fun. Ah, uh, even now. Jeez. Yep. Still fun. <laughs> oh dear. Good times. Alright, so we got this now. Oh! Uh, no, it doesn't help. Very excited. I got all excited for nothing. Terrible. Oh, it's okay. No, it's terrible. Don't say it's okay, it's terrible. Look, it's okay. Everything? Okay. Have you heard from Chad? Because, uh, have. I have a bit. Uh, it's been a while. Yeah, normally he, uh, touchy, hadn't been playing, hadn't been, hadn't heard from him, and any which way. She was, uh, regular, regularly, and, uh, uh, you know, I, uh, he would call me up when he was working, uh, going through stuff, and, haven't heard from him, so kind of wondering where he's been. I've sent him texts, and yeah. Anyway, anybody knows anything? Let me know. Quite tantalizingly close, but that that white so-called fizzler, which just. A floor. <laughs> uh, just it's uh, the, uh, the the technical name is the smoke. Uh, compressed smoke field. Yeah. Yeah, it's basically just a straight up wall that you can see. Yeah. Through. But a wall that you, a wall that you can remove. As opposed to, uh, if you were doing it in hand, you could have an actual wall, and then, and then the wall would retract. Yes. 
but they still wouldn't be able to see through it because it would be a wall and walls are solid well now i mean you wouldn't be able to see through it to sit on the button and like in this case the compressed smoke field uh when it disappears that would be like if you did it in ham the real wall it would track down sideways or whatever and then you would have no wall <laughs> And then it would act exactly the same. And then once you get off the button, the wall would go back up and you wouldn't be, able to, that's the only difference. You can't, you, you can't see it through a wall. You can see through a compressed smoke field wall. When I get into semantics, so. Uh, we'll get into some more. Semantics. I don't oh, think man, we need to. I, I think we're uh, good. What the? What? Me what? Lasers can't travel through walls. No, I'm. <laughs> I'm confused. It's having a. It's, it's just having a party and I think everyone's invited at this point. All right, well, I think I'm going to wrap it up here for tonight because um, I'm not bringing anything new to the table. I do still feel like Save. getting rid of the turret is the next job, the next thing for us to do. And there must be an angle somewhere that I am missing. Because I am not seeing a way from the panels and surfaces I'm looking at the moment that I can get rid of it because the I'm pretty sure, and this signage would back it up, that the laser has to come through here um, to be able to get rid has, of. Has to come. The laser has to come up your ass to the. <laughs> um. Interestingly. No. Okay. So yeah, um, let me make a uh, hard save of this. Our codes hell map. O one. Um, just so that we know where we are. But yeah, thank you very much, everybody, for tuning in. I uh, appreciate you, for you guys. For you know what, Deathwish, thank you for, like, being here and not being here and, you know. <laughs> conversation's been great. What can I say? <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. Well, thank you very much. Appreciate it. We'll be back tomorrow night um, taking a break from the puzzle solving. Tomorrow we'll be back doing, um, working on the map. So, yeah, we'll be doing uh, Hammer, just chilling, chatting stream tomorrow night. So uh, if you just want to chill. Uh, you know where to find us. Same time, same place. Usual shot of jazz. Thanks everyone for tuning in. Appreciate your support. And until next time, I'll be not keeping awesome. Take care. Stay safe. Hey, Cheers, guys. Bye. It's fun. It's it fun, fun watching Narc play around. <laughs> bye, guys. See you later. Say bye, Deathwish. Bye.